Good evening. I'm Jim Axelrod. For the third time in less than a month, the Islamic State of Iraq and Syria, the group of militants known as ISIS, has released a video purporting to show the execution of a Western hostage. This time, it's a 44-year-old from Scotland by the name of David Haynes, who was apparently brutally killed. He was a relief worker kidnapped in Syria last year as he delivered humanitarian aid. The video looks very much like the one showing two American journalists, James Foley and Stephen Sotloff, being beheaded by an ISIS militant. Elizabeth Palmer joins us now in London. Good evening, Liz. Good evening, Jim. The video purporting to show that execution of David Haynes was posted on social media today, and the executioner is apparently the same man who appeared in the two other execution videos you mentioned of the two Americans, and the method was the same, beheading. This British man has to pay the price. Haynes, who was 44 years old, had previously appeared kneeling and dressed in an orange jumpsuit in one of those videos, the one that showed Stephen Sotloff. His captors warned then that Haynes would be the next to die. Haynes was kidnapped by gunmen in March of 2013 when he was working for a French aid organization. He and an Italian colleague were abducted from their vehicle in northern Syria. The Italian was later released. On Friday, the Haynes family broke their silence and made a public plea to his captors to get in touch with them directly. Almost immediately, Britain's Prime Minister David Cameron tweeted that Haynes's murder was an act of pure evil. Jim? Elizabeth Palmer in our London newsroom. Liz, thank you.